We just need a word, please. Ski lift. Ski lift. Ski lift. Ski lift. Ski lift. Ski lift. A mechanized device that allows a newbie as well as an expert skier to enter into a little chair that takes them all the way up the mountain. Ski lift. You stir at the bottom, you go all the way to the top. <laughs> Moves very, very slowly. It's really monotonous. Are we ever going to get there? I'll teach you how to ski. Plenty of time to cuddle and ski. Really? Please? I don't think I'm ready for the Black Diamond. Takes you to another world. Ski it! Don't worry. We'll get you there. You can know where the, the, the Black Diamond Mountain is? Don't go up there. Don't go to the Black Diamond Mountain. Don't be a fool. Are you here for the Black Diamond Mountain? Yes. If you're here for the Black Diamond Mountain, you're in the right place. Tom. Yeah. Medic! <laughs> we need a medic! You're in, you're in the right place. You're in the right place. I, I the heard right the Black place. Diamond was. A lot of fun. It was. It is a lot of fun. You're gonna have the best time of your life. <laughs> hey, this is fun. You're this man is destroyed. This is what a black diamond does to you. You don't believe everything you hear, do you? You don't. Don't be fooled by them. You're going to have so much fun. All you have to do is head up the ski lift. Yes, right behind and us. Make your way down the mountain. People in the chair are overly optimistic about the black diamond. What's your name, son? Uh, Jim. Jim. I just came for a relaxing vacation. I, I don't. I don't want to. You're stay away from the black. There's nothing relaxing about the black. Oh, Jim, you have to do it. <laughs> it's so much fun. Oh, it's so much fun. Oh, Jim, you have to do it. It's so much fun. Such conflicting messages. Jim, save yourself. Get out. Jim, have you ever had to make a decision in your life that will change everything? Uh. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Oh. We're not making any money in this business, Tom. No. Selling empty shoeboxes was not a good plan. <laughs> it's our art design on the boxes. It's weak. It looks like third grade art. Look, you said that melons being held by third graders wearing blue pants would be attractive to adults. <laughs> I was wrong. <laughs> but I was committed to this, Steve. I sunk all of my life savings, $7,428.09, into this. It's important we carry you through. I don't think we've got much chance, though. The boxes are a failure. We need to change our We need to bring in a marketing agent. You're right. I called for one. He's going to be here any minute. God, you're thinking like a business guy. I knew we were going downhill. I didn't want to admit it to myself. But that's the first step, admitting your denial. This is Shields. This is my partner, Steve. He came up with the... Shields. 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 You look younger in the photograph. It's amazing what you can do with an iMac. <laughs> <laughs> I can spend hours, like, actually rotating the picture, taking out the blue tint. Look, we need a new marketing plan. Steve's boxes with the melons and the third graders in blue pants was terrible. It was wrong. I misjudged the market. I didn't do proper research. I thought reading an ink in a fortune magazine would be enough. But it wasn't enough. Have you considered cosmopolitan? Oh my god! Did you perhaps consider perusing cosmopolitan? No, we didn't think of the women's magazines. We just Thought of the youth magazine, the youth culture. Women love shoeboxes. Hmm? Steve, women love shoeboxes. Oh, I didn't know that. I thought they loved shoes. <laughs> Hi, you. No, no, actually, I, I buy the shoes just for the boxes. <laughs> my God, you're totally changing my view of women and 
with an approach to shoes. I thought it was all about gym shoes. I thought you walked into a place and said, hey, I really like your shoes, and you had a better chance of getting laid. But that's not the case. No. There, Steve, that's not the case. You should walk into a bar and say, I like your shoes. I bet they came in a wonderful box. Mm. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know. Try it on me. Try it on me. Pretend I'm somebody attractive. <laughs> hey, I bet those shoes came in a wonderful box. Oh, they did. How did that make you? Maybe feel really good. Listen, all this touch really crap is great, but I don't know how it's going to save us and our business, Miss Smarter Pants. Lost for words, huh? Happens a lot. That you're lost for words? Huh? Right? Businesses like ours find their way in that way. A little bit of both. A little bit of both. I have to admit, I'm feeling a little uncomfortable right now. Look, I feel uncomfortable too around two failures like us. I'm yeah. I'm sorry we made you come. We can't pay you either. I'm sorry I said that in my email. <laughs> That's all right. I used to men lying to me all the time. <laughs> Look, I'm, uh, I'm getting mixed signals from both of you, okay? It's an important decision. This is the most important decision. So do you approve of me marrying Melissa or not, Mom and Dad? Now, you should really think about this because it's a very important decision if you want to marry Melissa. I do. I mean... You are. Now, now, take some time just to think about marrying <coughs> Melissa. Think about what that would mean. It's a very important... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Do you know what marriage is? <laughs> I, I think so. I mean, I've we've been going out for, you know, six years Have you now. seen me and your mother? Seen us? Do you think we're happy? We're not happy. No. <laughs> I know. I know. Those people are, you tell me. It's not like spring break. Just, I, just I feel like we're pretty happy together. You've been dating how many years? Six years. Six, six, six years. years. Not six so years. many years. We, we were happy, we were happy after six years, but we were still happy. it didn't, the hard stuff didn't really get in until like the... It got hard at seven and a half, seven, yeah. all I'm saying. Oh, okay, look. Melissa's well, probably just like sucking in her gut, she's hiding all her flaws right now. Sucking it in. Imagine, imagine if she just let herself go. Okay, that really offends me. She's not sucking in her gut. I bet she's still waxing. <laughs> yeah. Kiss that goodbye. Kiss that goodbye. I'm gonna, I'm gonna marry her, and it's gonna be great. And I'm gonna marry her huh? next month. And you know what? You're invited. And you're just gonna have to deal with it. We'll come, but it won't be fun at the party. Because we'll be telling everyone about the time you also wanted a dog, and you didn't take care of that. Yeah. He, he had a dog for what? Six years? Six years. And guess what happened? Okay, that was a coincidence. <laughs> that was a <laughs> He was dying. I had to put him down. He was dying. What well, do you think, Mo? This is gonna live forever. <laughs> I am not gonna put my wife down. That is ridiculous. You may have to make decisions. <laughs> uh, oh, I'm so excited that we're gonna run this marathon. This is oh best decision we've ever made. I know, honey. I think it's really gonna be special for us. It's gonna bring us closer together. That's right. Except when we're running, we'll be far apart. Yeah. Yeah. We can't wait. There's one thing I have to tell you, though. I've never run a marathon before. Oh, honey. <laughs> <laughs> I've never run a marathon oh, oh, it feels like, oh, I'm so relieved because I thought, you know, I thought. This is the right stretch, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think so. Because you know, you know, on the on that Match.com profile when I said that I love the outdoors, I was I was totally lying. That was just to that was just to. I mean, I don't really care about the outdoors. I don't care about the outdoors. Oh, I'm so relieved. Oh, oh boy. Fact is. Oh, boy. <laughs> well, fact is. I went to college with your therapist. Oh. Wow. So I know all sorts of things oh, about so, <laughs> Oh my god, that's such a relief because I was afraid to tell you that I, I wet my bed till I was 12. 
I was so, <laughs> so, oh, I mean, you must know that. Tuck my leg. Okay. Just so we can get ready. Okay. Mm. I read my bed too till I was 12. It was all oh. the apple juice. Oh, good, good. And I figured, oh. since your father was so abusive. Yeah, he was. He was. That maybe during the race, we can send a message to him via video. Okay. <laughs> We can say things like, Dad, you beat me and now I'm running really far. Take a look at me now, Dad. And I have a girlfriend. Dad. <laughs> You've never used that word before. Oh, I'm sorry. Was that too premature? I knew you were going to do that. Okay. Just so I can be in the hospital. Me too. We need a doctor. <laughs> yeah. Oh we all we love can. hurting ourselves. Oh. I'm a big fan of the jello. <laughs> you know, my vacation this year, we just went to a spa where all you need to do is lay in a mud bath. Boring. I grabbed a chair and I broke my right leg with oh. it just so I could be here. This is smart. If I could just pull my leg right out of Catherine's back, I'd walk over there and give you a high five. Oh. <laughs> 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 I don't know what to do with it, but I don't know. Sarah, I don't know my life. I don't know what to do with it. Tony, I never understood. Tell me about it, Tony. <laughs> I admire how he's still drunk all the time. I think you know I'm going to do it. 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 Right? Right? You're a blues. It's like talking to an alien. He is truly an inspiration. I really thought that selling ice cream to Eskimos was going to be a good business plan. I did too. I really right? thought, I mean, that's, that's, that's what they're all about, right? right? How else are we going to keep the creeks cold? Cold weather. Right? right? Absolutely. Right? But you but know what? The girls love uh, igloos. They love them. They do? Yeah. I actually have uh, one of my Eskimo girls coming over a little later. Oh. Does she need ice? Yeah. I don't know if she needs ice cream, but she needs ice. Oh, so. okay. Is that, is that? I think that's her. She's banging on the outside of the <laughs> Hey, I'm too hot. Can I come in and cool down? Of course. Of course. <laughs> Just to, uh... We have an actual question. Yes. Oh, I have to pay. Uh, yeah. With, uh, whale blubber. We take whale blubber. Uh, we take uh, money. Well, we do have a lot of free samples. Oh, free samples. Free samples. This is um, Check it out. Eskimo chocolate. Okay. What's that? Is that like poop or is it real? No, it's, it's real. Okay. Tastes good. Yeah. I think you guys are on the up and up. Well, thanks. Yeah. Why do you, uh, why do you look so suspicious? I didn't know we weren't on the... Okay. Yeah. No, you are. Take yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. Now I can. Do you have any friends? I yeah. Mm -hmm. But they don't have any money. I thought this was free. Oh, they can come over. You know what? That's cool. I thought the part of our business plan was free. Right. So yeah, free ice cream <laughs> and chicks. Yeah. <laughs> You're Eskimo. You should be happy there. Hey! Nice. Thanks for calling me. Yeah. With my free. Oh hey, we got free samples. Friends. Free samples. Come yes. on, this is. Banana. Banana? Would you like fruit? Mm. It's really good. You guys have a really good business plan. We're on the up and up. We're on the up and up. We're on the up and up. Do you have any more friends? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I've 
did so. <laughs> God, there's just done some there's no research. This I know. There's idea. like four people that live in. I know this whole town. This. this whole town. I'm not happy. It's my fault. It is. It's my fault. We failed in raising you. It's so true. don't become an adult. I know you want to be an adult. I, I'm not asking for much. I just want to wax. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're, keeping, you're trying to keep me young and covered in hair. But I'm getting to the age now where I'm trying to date someone long enough that they'll marry me. And until then, I need to be hairless. And you know that. Sylvia. <laughs> you talk to us. <laughs> Sylvia. <laughs> You know what we discussed when you became, you started to become a woman? We talked about the changes that you were going through, how your father and I would support you. Guys, look, there are special places of your body where only certain people should touch. <laughs> and God gave you that hair. He's to protect you. It's to keep you warm. <laughs> <laughs> and you should be loved for who you are, not who someone wants you to be at some magazine like Cosmo. But in all the porns, none of the other girls with hair really <laughs> are a small Asian woman ripping hair from your nether regions. Really? Kind of, yeah. Because it gets the job done. Why couldn't you just consider Larger, thicker undies. Yes, your, your mother wears larger, thicker undies, and I love them. It pokes out of the undies. It's embarrassing. Guys, does listen. it poke out of your pants, too? Yes. <laughs> what? Yes. All of my denim. <laughs> That's what James will do. Hey, Mike. Hey, Nick. You know what? I'm really glad we got a close friendship. Me too. Yeah, I've uh Me too. I mean I I just love, you know, hanging out with you and you know, just watching you, you know, and you get up in the morning and uh, Me too. I like being close to you. I know, I know. I feel like I know everything about you, you know? We don't have we don't have any secrets between each other. There's one thing I've been meaning to tell you. I uh I've never actually shot a gun before. I just thought you wanted me to do that kind of stuff, so I told you that. Well, I mean, that's going to make this duel a little unfair, but... <laughs> <laughs> well, I figured you got the message. I mean, I said hi to you in the kitchen. I thought you knew what I meant. Yeah, yeah, I know. I, well, this is one thing I did not know about you. Well, look, I want this to be fair, so... So what do you want me to do about it? I know how to shoot. I'm actually a pretty good marksman. Two minutes to duel. Two minutes to duel. We got you ready. Glad I installed that. Yeah. <laughs> look. Look, I have another one, right? Just... Maybe you should have two guns. You're the one who can't. I've never shot about that. Don't worry. You are very resourceful. That, that I did know about you. Yeah, I came prepared. I said hi to you. I was a fool around. Hey, look, I'll let you have the first shot. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just, just go ahead. Just take, just take a shot. Hey, sorry, there you go. You know, I just wanted to go and say... You're, you're in the middle of something very heavy right now. Ah! <laughs> oh, damn it! <laughs> look, look, half minute to duel. Half minute, minute to duel. <laughs> I'm really not very good at this. You have to wait till the, till the buzzer. You can't just start. Look, I'll give you another try. Just really okay. Just wait to let me know that I'm in love with you. Okay. This can wait. Look, this can wait. Ah! <laughs> he said he loved me. Can you just sorry oh, wait for the buzzer? Just sorry. wait for it. Fifteen seconds to do. You hear that? Fifteen seconds to do. Count fifteen Mississippi before you pull the trigger. Okay. Okay. Hey, I. I just wanted to let you know. That Please just get out of here. Get your ass out of here right now. You're in danger. <laughs> I 
I heard this movie, guys, is so scary. I heard it's like, it's like a musical, but scarier. <laughs> scary like a musical, scary like a musical. Don't, don't, you oh. don't, 
The isolation in that comfortable little box. The, you watch you know they TV? served us on our flight oh. to Zurich? Oh, God, don't oh, give this up. Oh. I want some Pinot. But I don't know what that is. It sounds so Pino. good. You're better off that way. If you go to Nova Community College, hey. you'll know. But she we went knows. ahead and just sent in your decline letter to Harvard. Yeah. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, that's so... My dream you guys crushed. Oh, no, that's a hard dream. It's a hard dream. You crush your fucking dream. <laughs> <laughs> Ski lift! 